Hello, and we are back with another conversion of your factors, of your units, using your dimensional analysis. So for this example, we will be doing conversion of 10.0 imperial gallons into its corresponding value in US gallons. Now remember, as I've mentioned in the previous video, that the unit gallons has been used in the previous years, and it has various values and this here are two of the various values that the gallon unit has now the imperial gallon usually also known as the UK gallon is usually used in Commonwealth countries okay well this one is of course is the US version of that unit so we now do the calculation the given is 10.0 imperial gallons we have abbreviated the imperial gallons to imp.gallons that is the abbreviation of the unit then we have here two blanks telling us that we need two equivalent statements for us to solve this problem and get the value in the unit of the US gallons so we have to know first our equivalent statements and write them here and there we have written our equivalent statements needed for this conversion 1 imperial gallon is equal to 4.546 liters, while 1 US gallon is equal to 3.785 liters. Okay, So we now transform these equivalent statements into the corresponding conversion factor to see the cancellation of units. So the first conversion factor that we need should contain the imperial gallon unit, and this is the equivalent statement. And we can transform that into the con conversion factor and write that here. There, we now have written this equivalent statement into the corresponding conversion factor. Remembering the units should be properly placed to see the cancellation. The given units in imperial gallons, so the denominator should contain the imperial gallon units. Then we cancel them out, and we are left with the unit in liters. So we now need the next conversion factor, which we will be getting from this equivalent statement, and write down here. And there you go, we now have written the equivalent statement in the corresponding conversion factor and to see the cancellation of units we now have the unit liters in the denominator for us to cancel this unit here okay remember the capital L here stands for the unit liters so we now have arrived to our final desired unit which is in the unit US gallons then we do the calculation to arrive to our final answer and our final answer is equal to 12.0106 US gallons. Now remember, in determining the correct number of significant figures in your final answer, you have to go back to the given. And we are given with 10.0, and that is only contains three significant figures. And remember, this equivalent statements here will not determine the number of significant figures because these are uh, approximately constants. Okay, so they will not give us the number of significant figures. So we have three significant figures in our given. So our final answer should also contain only three significant figures. So our final answer is equal to 12.0 US gallons. So let me just cross this out so it will not confuse you. And this is our final answer with the correct number of significant figures. 12.0 US gallons. So that is the amount in US gallons equivalent to 10.0 imperial gallons that's all for this example thank you for listening and continue learning